All right, hey everybody. Uh, today we're gonna talk about how to make your own DSLR rig like this one uh, for basically no money and incorporating all the necessary uh, DSLR components like your microphone, uh, your video light, your Nintendo controller, compass, your iPod. Uh, we're gonna talk about how to do all that stuff and uh, additionally attach your GPS unit so you always know where you are for video shoots. So let me uh, take you through this, uh, gather your materials, let's get started. Okay, so obviously the first thing you're gonna need is your uh, your DSLR camera. And I've just got my, uh, you know, Canon here with my regular lens on it. But I also have a uh, P-Series filter ring adapter uh, so that I put on the edge. So what I can do with this, once I have it on, is take out my old school Koken and P-Series filter set and add it to the front of the lens like this. So I've got a bit of a shield, but also I've got a gradated blue filter on here. And you can add a bunch of different filters. Plus it just looks really cool, like your camera does more than the average camera. So that's the first step. Next, I've got this uh, crazy contraption. This is an old school um, pre-DSLR flash holder. So it's, uh, you know, you screw your camera on the bottom here, and then it's um, it's got an adjustable thing for your flash. But we're not going to use it for a flash. Uh, it just looks really cool. And I've also added a special handle on the side. You can get these online for like $5. It has a hot shoe on one end, and uh, it just screws on the bottom. So what we're going to do is take our camera and put it on here, and uh, screw the camera onto the flash mount. So we've got this. Next you want to get one of these. This is a hot shoe microphone clip. It's probably six dollars online. We're just going to slide it here into where the flash should go and tighten it down and that's going to let us attach our shotgun mic which I've got here and uh, it just goes on like that. So we've got our shotgun mic on then we're going to run around our cable and plug it into the audio input on the side of our cannon here. All right, so that's, we're getting there. So now we've got a basic uh, contraption. Uh, next, we probably want to add uh, an iPod on the side so that when you're out doing film shoots and whatnot and you're standing around, you've got something to listen to. So we're going to take this iPod and uh, strap it on the side here using this handy Velcro clip. So now we've got our, uh, our iPod ready to rock there on the side. Now let's say, again, uh, you know, that you're in a low light situation. You may need some additional light and can't afford a really expensive light. You can get this book light with uh, this clip and just simply add it onto your contraption like this. And now you've got this killer LED book light uh, to provide lighting for your dark lighting situations, all right? So those are a few steps in the right direction, but let's say you're out and you may need a GPS unit. Um, you could Velcro a GPS unit right on the back so that you always know where you are for filming purposes, especially if you're filming a Blair Witch Project out in the woods. But uh, in case the battery dies, you may also want this compass with matching book light um, with a cigarette adapter. And uh, what you can do is insert that into your Velcro attachment so that you have your compass on the top and it can hover there and help you know which direction uh, you're heading. But let's say you're still at home, you're more in a technological context, you may desire to have your original NES Nintendo controller on here so that uh, you can be playing your NES in between shoots. So we'll go ahead and stick that here too so that that's on board for our rig and then we'll just want to add the uh, the wire here and set it up but let's just say that's not even enough and you need more light um, what you can do is take off the book light hook it here on your speaker and then purchase one of these uh, giant t double bar LED lights and hook that on the top too so with this uh, with this setup here we're pretty much equipped for anything you've got your uh, entertainment controls you've got all the technical aspects that you need um, you've got your P-series filter ring uh, as well as your shotgun microphone and uh, enough applications to successfully light and film uh, in any context. So that's all for today. I hope you've learned a lot and uh, with a few short hours of work and some ingenuity you can assemble your own DSLR rig and go um, film and conquer the creative ventures that you're considering for the future. See you later.